It's a pleasure to introduce the World Cities Report 2016 uh, about urbanization and development. Uh, this is a crucial report uh, on the way towards Habitat 3 uh, and also after the 2030 Sustainable Development uh, Agenda where finally uh, urbanization has been singled out uh, in the goal number 11 as a tool for development. Uh, usually we tend to see uh, urbanization from the needs point of view, the needs of the population. And, uh, but uh, apart from looking at the needs, which is very important, we need to look also at the capacity of urbanization to generate uh, prosperity. Uh, it's obvious that general, uh, urbanization can generate prosperity uh, because we know that uh, uh, urbanization by now stands at around 50-55% of the world population, but we know that it produces already between 70 and 80% of the GDP of the world. And that means that the productivity of urbanization is very high. And if we want to invest in development, it's good to invest in urbanization because urbanization accelerates uh, uh, and qualifies development. That has been the case during all the Industrial Revolution, at least uh, since uh, 16th century, 17th century. But now this is taking a new stage in the 21th century, where a lot of economies in the world are migrating for manufacturing to a post-manufacturing uh, economy, from industrialization to a post-industrial uh, economy, where uh, most of the GDP of the country is generated by services, and inside the services, the most productive uh, services are the high-value added services. And uh, where are those high-value added services uh, grown? Where are the fields where we cultivate these uh, uh, high value added services in the cities. This is the new paradigm. Uh, in the rural areas, of course, we generate uh, food and we can extract minerals, uh, the primary sector of the economy. But as we are moving to the tertiary uh, uh, economy, uh, a new relevance, a new strategic role uh, is assigned to urbanization. And then no country can prosper without, uh, uh, in that mm, trajectory, without investing in uh, urbanization. This is a crucial uh, fact of, of, of the modern times. It's going to be very relevant in the 21th century, and I think that this report helps a lot to uh, specify in this issue and also presents an outline of what could be uh, the new urban agenda that we hope is going to be agreed in uh, uh, Quito uh, on, on, on the occasion of the Habitat 3. Let's take a, a new look uh, to urbanization in order uh, to see if we are able to develop new strategies to improve the quality of urbanization, which at the end is the quality of life of our people, uh, as most of them uh, uh, it's going are moving to the cities and as we know in, in the forthcoming decades the overall majority of the people will live in cities.